What's good everybody? My name is Josh aka Jace the Dawn and today we will be talking about a show that I haven't heard about in a year. Today we will be talking about Close Enough. If you have not watched the show, I definitely recommend watching the show. It is on HBO Max and it comes on TBS a little late at night. I definitely suggest the show. But first, before we get into the discussion, I want you to like comment subscribe share the video and turn on those post notifications it really does help out the channel now without further ado let's hit the intro Yeah. So where we left off, season two was released last year, and we got confirmation that a season three was renewed. Is renewed? The close enough was renewed for season three. The excitement, the hype level was immaculate, and I was just all year. I was like, "When are we gonna get some news on season three? When are we gonna get some news on season three? When are we gonna get some news on season three? I need season three news. I need it. Please give it to me. You know, I, you know, I was just like, I need something. So it turns out there was some news on July 13th of 2021. It was revealed on a podcast. It was the Wise Cracks, the Squatch is a Rick and Morty podcast. And it was revealed by Sierra Cattell that writing for season three had been wrapped. So season three writing was wrapped by then. Uh, so I'm pretty sure after that, you know, they worked on production. So I went on Twitter recently and something was shared that I found rather interesting. So on January 29th, 2022 was just a few days ago it was confirmed on twitter by head writer bill oakley that production for season three had been wrapped here's what he had to say in his tweet he said that today we wrapped production on the third season of close enough and i got this excellent going away card from jg quintel and the staff no I am always depicted in my chef jacket on the show. Awesome art by Sid Ding. Thank you. And I will have a picture up and it says, Bill, thank you for all the great stories. And they have, you know, his character animated in a chef jacket, like he said in his tweet. So yeah, I will leave a link to that tweet in the description below if you want to check it out. I'm, you know, I'm ready for the show to come out. Um, the question is now, when will season three come out? And that's the thing. We don't really know. It hasn't been confirmed when it comes out. There hasn't been any promotion or commercials as of yet, because I believe they're still they're in post-production. Uh, they want to make sure everything is edited and uh you know, every music and balancing all the things that a show's process has to go through before they can release it. Um, so these are my predictions. Now, bear in mind, I said predictions. These are not confirmations. I don't know any information. I'm like everyone else. I'm trying to figure out when the show comes out. So this is my prediction. 
I think the show is going to come out either late spring or early summer. So I'd say I'll give you a range between late April and early June. I'll say that that's my pr prediction for when the show comes out. Because again, you know, you with production, you have to do post-production and all the things like that. So that is my prediction of when the show comes out. Again, this is not a confirmation. It's just a prediction. I just want to put that out there. Um, so yeah, like I said, I'm, I'm excited for the show. This is one of my favorite adult animation shows. This and Final Space, which sadly Final Space ended. And, you know, I, I, I was really emotional when Final Space ended because that show was so good. Olen Rogers, you know, he's just... What he brought to that show was just so unique and so different. And I hope that that show comes back. I hope it comes back someday. I would love for it to come back, finish the story, uh, tell more to the story. There's so much. I would definitely recommend checking out Close Enough and Final Space. They're, they're goaded shows. Um, but anyway, yeah, that's pretty much all I have on information. I'm just, I'm hyped for Close Enough. I was a big fan growing up as a little kid. I remember when a uh, regular show first appeared. Uh, the first episode came on and I fell in love with the first episode. I was like, this is going to be my new favorite show. And it lasts eight seasons. And I tell you, everything that happened in that first season came back full circle in the last season. And the ending. The ending was beautiful. Sad, but beautiful beautiful and I can already tell close enough that this show is going to come back in full circle like regular show did but in a very different way I think close enough is what we wanted regular show to be if it was on like Adult Swim or TBS late at night I think this is what regular show is but it's very different from regular show now that doesn't mean that they don't put Easter eggs of regular show in close enough because they have the house um, in season two. Uh, I think it was the episode where Candace, which is Josh, Josh's daughter, they um, have like her lunchbox as the regular show characters on the lunchbox, which is just like very dope. Like I said, little Easter eggs in there, like that, that just, you know, they bring back so much as a fan of regular show and a JG Quintel fan. Um, if you really, if you have not checked out his work, like I definitely would recommend. Uh, I think it's like the Lolly Man, the Naive Man of Lollipop, or something like that. And 2 A.M. in the P.M. I think that's the name of it. Um, that was actually the first time we actually seen Mordecai and Benson from Regular Show, I believe. So that was dope. Um, like I said, I will leave all the tweets and stuff in the description below. I'm excited. I can't wait for this show to come out. How do I leave you? Big love to you all. Thank you for supporting me. I hope you have a good day, a good week. Whenever you see this, I hope, I hope nothing but good things for you. And I'll see you later. And don't forget, before I go, don't forget to like comment share subscribe and turn on your post notifications it really does help out the channel like for real it really does and i'll see you later bye